This episode deal, deals with the relationship between obesity and heart disease. Obesity by itself can't easily be linked with heart disease, but through diabetes, which it frequently results in, can produce some adverse effects that are life-threatening. When one has a heart attack nowadays, usually the first heart attack, if it can be diagnosed in time, can be well treated with a number of possible procedures, including what's called angioplasty, or actually, um, to some degree, uh, some operations that can uh, put a stent in. But this is not necessarily the fate of people who have subsequent heart attacks. That is, a second heart attack is much more serious in terms of its consequences. However, when you have diabetes that is usually the result of obesity, this is so-called type 2 diabetes for the most part, you are set up as if you had already a heart attack. That is, the first heart attack that occurs is actually your second in terms of the outlook, the prognosis as it's called. The um, future of a person with uh, more than one heart attack is much more serious than with a single heart attack. Now, there are important issues here. I think that we have to address the weight loss that leads to diabetes, which is something we've covered before in previous episodes. But in addition to that, there are some accompaniments that are not necessarily directly the result of obesity, but often go with it, namely hypertension or high blood pressure and high uh, cholesterol and a disturbed cholesterol relationship that uh, I won't go into at the moment. But these have to be addressed as well. In other words, there are, they can be uh, dealt with by special uh, dietary measures, but usually it requires some form of medication to produce a uh, normalization of these compelling and contributing factors to heart attacks. So here we have a model of obesity, which is a uh, time bomb that leads, if it's not controlled, to diabetes, and that in turn leads to heart attacks that can end unnecessarily fatally. So what do we do? Well, we take obesity seriously. We're trying to say that obesity, which is a growing problem throughout the world, and um, this is something that is not just a frivolous sort of uh, accompaniment that has to be treated uh, casually. One has to deal with obesity as if it's the door opener to fatal heart attacks, because that's truly the case. So how do we deal again with obesity? Well, we do it in two ways. We do it, as I've mentioned, we lower the insulin by a measure of uh, low carbohydrate diet and also aerobic exercise. And we also improve the quality of sleep using our special magic medicine called trazodone, which gives serotonin to make sleep more productive and restorative. 